How to Watch the Ada Aquarid Meteor Shower 2018, Shooting Stars from Halley's Comet to Light Up the Night Sky Britain will enjoy an astonishing celestial display this week as debris from the famous comet plunges into our atmosphere. Shooting stars spawned by history's most famous comet will be visible from the UK over the weekend. The Eta Aquarids is an annual event that occurs when Earth passes through a stream of ice and dust left in the trail of Halley's Comet. The comet produces two meteor showers, the Eta Aquarids, which are always visible in May, and the Orionids, which are visible in October. What are the Eta Aquarids? The Eta Aquarid meteors are formed from debris shed by Halley's Comet, which is best known for its appearance in the Bayox Tapestry. Discovered in 1705 by Edmund Halley, Halley's Comet takes about 76 years to complete one orbit around the Sun. The last time it swung past the Earth was in 1986, when the comet could be seen as a smudge of light in the night sky. Its next appearance will be in 2062, but each year tiny particles from the comet the size of grains of sand burn up in the atmosphere. This results in a shower of shooting stars over the Earth, a display that attracts stargazers around the world. Why is it called the Eta Aquarids? This is because the meteor shower appears to emerge from the constellation of Aquarius located in the southern hemisphere, which might make some of the shooting stars difficult to see. As Dara Patel, an astronomer at Royal Observatory Greenwich, explains, at this time of the year, much of Aquarius remains below the horizon until the pre-dawn hours. For those of us in the Northern Hemisphere, this meteor shower is not favorably placed. Why does it occur? Meteoroids from Halley's Comet, officially designated 1P Halley, strike the Earth's atmosphere at an approximate speed of 150,000 miles per hour, 240,000 kilometers per hour, burning up in the process. Ims Patel said, as the dust descends through the Earth's atmosphere it burns up, producing the streaks of light that we refer to as meteors. When will the Eta Aquarids be visible? The Eta Aquarids will rain down on Earth most visibly on early Monday morning in a breathtaking astronomical spectacle. The shower is visible from late April to near the end of May, but Ms. Patel, reckons the best time to see it will be on Monday between midnight and dawn when the sky is darkest and the shower will be at its brightest. She said, typically, after midnight would be a good time to look for meteors but for the Ada Aquarids you'll need to wait until the early hours, around 3 a.m. to 4 a.m. The waning gibbous moon is also close by, meaning there is likely to be interference from moonlight. Sky watchers in the southern hemisphere will have the best view of the meteors but from the UK it should be possible to spot up to 30 per hour. How to Watch the Eta Aquarids Although they can show up anywhere in the sky, the Eta Aquarids appear to originate from the direction of the constellation Aquarius in the northeast. The best time to see them is just before dawn from a dark location in the countryside. Ims Patel advises getting far away from all artificial lights. She said, it's best to head away from the city to a rural location where there are few buildings and trees to obscure your view of the southeastern horizon in particular. Heading to higher altitudes may also make viewings easier. Remember, the best tool for the job is your eyes as they give you the widest field of view. It will be challenging to spot meteors from this shower but some do leave persistent trains so you could still spot a few. Another way to view the meteor shower is via the SLU website, which uses robotic telescopes to give everyone the chance to be an astronomer.